Lucy and I'm going to do another tag for you. This is the accent tag. Um, it circulated a long time ago but Amber F tried to bring it back a little while ago so I thought I would do it and yeah. So I'm going to do the accent tag. Um, there's 30 words or phrases um, which I will put down below so you guys can check them out. Um, I'm just going to say them how I'd normally say them. I'm Australian so I've kind of got a, I've got an Aussie accent, obviously, um, and I kind of have like, I think my Australian accent is pretty thick compared to other people's, and like when I went overseas, it was, I out of the six people that I went overseas with, I had the strongest Australian accent, in my opinion. So let me know if you think I've got a strong accent or not. But anyway, I'm going to read out these words so we can, yeah, just have fun with it. Okay, so the first word is garage, um, like where you put your car. Herb, Mexican, schedule, figure, water, leisure, salmon, fire, ruin, New Orleans, or New, Orle New Orleans, New Orleans. Spitting image, probably, coupon, aunt, roof, syrup, caramel, uh, cauliflower, creek, mayonnaise, survive, lawyer, Monday, pajamas, mosquitoes or mozzies. We don't really say mosquitoes here, we just say mozzies. Root, like... Traveling, like traveling, then you're taking a route. Uh, almond. I hate when people say almond. I'm like it's almond, not almond. Supermarket, or we just say Coles or Woolies. Well, Woolies here because I mean New South Wales, but like, yeah, Coles or Woolies. Um, and mare. And then there are a couple of questions. Um. <coughs> So, um, so the first question is, what do you call a carbonated drink? So, fizzy drink? Or, so, like, some people call it soft drink, but I say fizzy drink. Um, the second one is a spider with oval body and long legs. I'm assuming that's a daddy long legs. Um, three, a mini lobster that lives in fresh water. I'm assuming they're talking about prawns. It frustrates me so much when people, like, come to Australia or talk about Australians and they're like, oh, put a shrimp on the barbie. I'm like, well, we don't actually call it shrimp here. It's prawns. So, really, the phrase doesn't make sense because no one actually says shrimp here. It's prawns. So, it's put a prawn on the barbie. What do you call gym shoes? Um, we call them joggers, or like occasionally you might find someone that calls them trainers, but I call them joggers. What do you call the bug that balls up when you touch it? I have no idea what this is. Um, I kind of feel like they're talking about a Christmas beetle, but I could be totally wrong. So I'm not entirely sure what that one is. What do you use to carry your food at the grocery store? A trolley? What's your word if something is diagonally across from you? Like, this one doesn't even make sense. Like, they're across from you. They're not in front of you, they're not next to you, they're just across from you. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that one. Sorry! What do you call a big road you drive rev relatively fast on? Um, depending on the road, it's either a freeway or a motorway. Um, not all of them are freeways, because some of them are toll. Like, some of them have toll on it, so they're not free but like so you've got like the m5 which is free but you've got the m7 which is a toll so it's a motorway not a freeway does that make sense either freeway or motorway what do you call the gunk in your eyes sleep what do you call an easy class i don't understand what that means i don't know what they mean by an easy class they're talking about class system or they're talking about like school class i don't know what is the small road relative to the highway? I'm assuming when they're talking about like the on-ramp, so I don't know. 
just the exit and the entrance. Like, we don't really... I'm assuming that's what they're talking about. Anyway. And the last one, popular kid activities unique to where you're from. Um, at the moment, all the kids are like... Oh, well, not at the moment. I don't know exactly what they're in at the moment. But current, like, recently, kids have been really into those... Um, oh, gosh, what are they called? Loom bands, that's what they're called. Um, kids have been really into those in the past couple of years. Um... Yeah, I don't know if that's, like, unique to Australia, but kids are, like, really hyped up about loom bands, so I'm going to say that. That is all the questions, and that's all for this tag. So if you want to do this tag, go ahead and do it. Um, I'll probably tag a couple of people down below. Don't forget to comment down below with any questions or comments. Like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time. Bye for now.